Hey guitar fam, how's it going? It's Nate here. I have a question for you, so make sure to leave a comment below to kind of weigh in on this. Uh, here it is. Do you think private lessons are worth it? Are private lessons something you're currently doing or something that you want to do? Uh, my perspective on it is it's. I think it's always the best to learn from as many sources as possible. That way you get better faster and iron out wrinkles and you're playing faster. Um, a lot of people still don't know that I am actually doing one-on-one -on -one private lessons and they are extremely effective over the last year uh, with a lot of students. But don't take my word for it. I have some testimonials coming up about the lessons uh, that you'll want to check out if you've been thinking of taking private lessons. And don't forget the first one is complimentary. Enough of me talking about it. Listen to these guys. I'm an old guy. I used to play guitar when I was younger, but I stopped playing in my 20s for whatever reason. I didn't pick it back up again for decades. Um, when I turned 50, I decided I wanted to play again. Uh, no big dreams of being a rock god this time. I just want to be the best guitarist and musician I can be. Um, I spent a few uh, years reacquainting myself with my guitar. There are plenty of tabs and tutorials online, but those methods only got me so far. Uh, one online instructor I stumbled across was Nate Savage, and his style of teaching seemed to align with my style of learning. When I found uh, Nate was doing one-on-one -on -one lessons, I reached out to him. And after the first free lesson with Nate, I committed to some more, and I've been a student of his for five months now. Uh, my practice is more focused, and uh, I'm making progress, and my goals seem more tangible. Uh, with Nate's instruction, and the support of the entire guitar fam, uh, I feel like I will become the best guitarist I know I can be, and maybe, I'll even become that rock god. Time will tell. Hey from Boston. I just want to tell you that two best decisions I ever made was buying this guitar and the other one is taking a class with Nate. He is awesome. Hi, I'm Gregor, uh, an actor from Germany and a student of Nate's. And a year ago, I was in search for a guitar teacher because I had to learn the guitar for a play I did this year. So I had uh, one year to go from zero to 100, basically. Um, and I chose Nate as my teacher because he was the first one I found online who actually told you how to learn something and not just what you needed to do, like for this song, grab this chord and this chord. No, he actually told told you um, how to learn a chord in the first place and so I chose Nate and in hindsight it was the right decision because his teaching skills and encouragement um, helped me develop the guitar chops I needed to do the show and it was a great success so if you're on the fence of taking lessons with Nate uh, just, just give it a go I mean you won't regret it I mean I know I haven't Hi guitar fam uh, I want to talk to you today. I'm Joe. I've been taking lessons with Nate for a little more than a year now. And um, my testimony is, first of all, this is definitely something you should do if you're thinking of uh, wanting to learn to play the guitar. But there are so many testimonials out there that say, do this, go with this guy. Um, why is this one different? This one is different because Nate is a very patient teacher. He knows everything there is to know. Um, he can see things in you long before you see them. But what I really want to encourage you to do is, um, if you're watching this, you're probably going to go ahead and take him up on the free offer to, um, you know, have a lesson for free. Um, do that. Go through with it. But once you get signed up, once you get going with your lessons, the thing that I really think that um, I would want to impress upon you is consistency. Um, in my own self, I've found that when I wasn't consistent, I didn't get the same results as when I focused on consistency. Um, small amounts frequently, um, trying to do weekly lessons if you can, but certainly every two weeks for sure. Um, I think those kinds of things will help you a great deal. Um, realize that Nate is the teacher, but he needs your help. Um, you've got to do your part. But if you do your part, um, this is by far without a shadow of doubt, the best lessons that you can take, the best investment you can make in yourself when it comes to learning to play the guitar. I don't think you'll be disappointed. And what have you got to lose? The first lesson's free anyway. 
give it a shot. If you don't like it, don't do it, but um, I think you're going to like it. So I hope my video testimony helps. Um, I hope it encourages you to go ahead and take the opportunity that's there and take that free lesson. I, I just really don't think that you're going to be disappointed if you take the free lesson. So um, I hope it helps. Um, have a great day. Thank you for listening. Um, and Nate, I love you, man. So don't forget to leave your comments below. Do you think private lessons are worth it? Are they something that you want to do? There's something you're like, eh, I'm a little bit too shy to do that. Uh, it's always worth considering, I think. And remember, if you want to go to guitarfam.com and sign up for private lessons, the first one is complimentary, so there's absolutely no risk. It's just a great time for me to get to know you and kind of get a plan ironed up. And then you can go from there if you want to book more with me. See you there.